Welcome to your lesson in French backbalance into salto. I really like this because it's a beautiful drop, but it does not take up a lot of height. And there's a lot of pretty shapes within it. You'll begin from a hip key. After you've arrived in your hip key, your bottom hand grabs the tail, wrap your bottom leg three times. On each wrap, notice I'm pulling the tail up slightly. I do this so the wraps stay above my knee. After you have that on, bend your bottom leg to keep your wraps in place. Your right arm reaches through if your right leg is wrapped, and then you go into this shape, which is our French back balance pose. The free leg hooks over both pole ends. Keep your bottom leg bent as you climb above your knee. Pass your shoulders to the front, and here's our salto. We open the arms to the side, forward flip. Sometimes it happens where the tail drapes over your arm like it happened for me, which looks really pretty. And then to get out of it, you just unwind your wraps and it's off. Okay, so we'll do this again. Hip key, lifting the outside leg up nice and high so the fabric is truly up and over the hips. The fabric must be on your lower back for this, otherwise you can slip when you do the drop. Fabric has to be up high enough. Three wraps on your bottom leg. After you've completed your three wraps, bend your bottom leg to keep your wraps in place. The pull end above you, find the middle. Whichever leg has the wraps on, that same arm reaches through the center. I turn on my back, keeping again the bent leg bent and arrive in a back balance shape. Arching your upper back over the pull end of the fabric. And I think this is a really beautiful line. Okay, and then next up, we hook our free leg, which in my case is the left leg, over both pole ends and begin to climb above your knee. And this is where it's tempting to straighten your leg. Try your best to keep that leg bent so you do not lose your wraps. We have three on just so you have a lot of safety when you flip. If you only had one, this would not work. The third is just an extra safety. Now I make sure my right foot is not behind the pole. It's a little bit to the side as I release my hands. Magically, the tail might drape over your shoulder. Release the tail off and then unwind the wrap off your legs. All right, so this is a relatively simple drop once you have this set up. And as long as you open your arms to the side and make sure that your foot is not going to catch on the pole as you rotate, you should be good to go. All right, guys, that was your French back balance into Salto.